All right, so this is the Elm Eco Pro 2 DVD and Blu-ray uh, disc resurfacer. Right now, the compound here that's used for polishing is clogged in the tubes. So I did the typical um, running the pump in reverse and forward and all the other uh, troubleshooting steps, and it did not help. So to run it um, in forward you hold stop and tap function and to run it in reverse you hold start and stop and then tap function so this has been sitting for i don't know like a year at least so i'm going to take it apart and see if i can't fix the problem Okay, apparently there's also uh, some kind of a mod where you take uh, tape and wrap it around here. Um, that somehow helps with uh, pumping out a compound. Okay, how am I supposed to get to that one? Oh, it's loose already. Cool. Screwing that in is going to be real fun. Okay. Going to have to clean all this stuff. There's a little, I didn't notice there's a little uh, COM port here. I wonder what you can do with that. I'm gonna connect that up and see what it shows on the, on putty. Interesting. hinge has to be locked in the metal right there. I can see. It. Oh, there's some dried compound right there. I can just grab a little bit. These three screws that go into the top, there's actually one that's different. Um, right here. I was wondering why only two of them had the little um, washers on them. And the one that's, uh, the different one goes on the left side if you're facing the machine. can't get anything to come out try and blow in them either one nothing at all oh and I see these the compound line goes all the way around here I thought this was some kind of a belt or something that's kind of weird So that's, I guess this squeezes the compound out when it rotates. 
That's crazy. Okay. I can already see some flat spots right here. You see where it's skinnier? Let's see. Zoom. Okay. Uh, right there. Flat spot. And there may be more, but this side, flat spot. I think it's in like the same, yeah, same area, flat spot. That's probably the problem. Oh, there it is. There's some compound. Well, the most solid that I've found so far. Okay, airflow through there. This one's still clogged. There it goes. Explosion. Bunch of dried compound. Well, it's turning. Yeah, it's impossible to show you this, but there's the bit that <laughs> the pliers. Got it out. Let's see. Right there. And just popped it right out of here. It was just in there pretty snug. Pop out pretty easy. There we go. It's completely out. Guaranteed I can see that this is blocked. Oh wow. Do you see all that? Okay, I wanted to mention uh, this little mod that I did that was mentioned. Um, I actually found it at the company's website. So it's basically just take two, just take some uh, household tape, wrap it around right here, and only wrap it around two times. Um, and I guess this part gets worn down, and this makes it a little bit thicker, and it helps somehow. I'm not exactly sure how, but um, yeah, I did it to mine. All right, I finally got this thing back together. It was a nightmare, but moment of truth. I'm gonna turn it on and see. First, I'm gonna do the water, and it's gonna take a minute. Okay, cool. Screen still works, nice. Okay, so this should be the water. Water pump is on, and it's got a lot of air in it right now, so it's gonna take a while. I can see it moving. Okay, I'm running the compound right now, and it's only coming out of one nozzle. Oh, both of them now. 
Finally. Okay. Nice. Okay, it's hot. Okay, it looks looks better. Um Let's run it one more time, see if we can get there's about four or five like obvious scratches three right next to each other try it again okay I mean I still see two big scratches and some other little scratches three big scratches Maybe I didn't get all the air out of the lines first with the water. Okay, now there's water coming out for sure. Try one more time. Okay. It looks even better. Still like minor scratches and two kind of kind of deep scratches. Okay, I'm gonna try to get these last line scratches. I wonder how many times you can run this. So see if the water's coming out. Yep. Still has two scratches there. Um, let's see, it might be impossible to show you. Okay, let's see. Uh, I could still see the two scratches. I mean, the disc is way better than it was. Um, and it might be fine, I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to get those last two scratches.